What's good YouTube, it's Adam from My Music Mogul and welcome to another remake video. In this one, we're gonna go ahead and remake the baby's track in Stunna for Vegas, no dribble, so let's get straight to it. First things first is going to change our tempo to 130 beats per minute. And I'm gonna go ahead and bring in a preset here. It's actually a preset from the sounds of Metro Boomin' Kit. Uh, there's a sound that sounds very close to the one in the original track itself. Uh, I'm gonna go to the Sounds of Metro Boomin and I'm gonna bring in the keys, uh, the Metro Electric preset. And uh, let's go ahead and draw that in. And those two chords just simply repeat itself, so we're going to do that. All right, so there is our main sound, but now we're going to go ahead and layer it up. So let's go ahead and create a new software instrument track. We're going to go over to our browser tool right over here. We're going to go to Vintage Clav. We're going to go to Experimental, and we're going to go to Clav. Auto wah, wah. <laughs> and uh, we're gonna go ahead and just duplicate down this pattern, pitch it up one, and we kind of get like that initial wah sound at the top of it. All right, next is going to create a new software instrument track. And uh, we're gonna bring in a sound here that happens, I don't know, every so often there's like sort of this one note lead sound. And we're gonna draw that in right now. So let's go ahead and create a new region over here. And for that sound, we are going to bring in synthesizer. We're gonna go to pad and we're going to go to, uh, I believe it was called the classic brass pad. And we're just gonna draw in one note here. And it's gonna be like that. The only thing I'm going to do here is bring in a reverb. We'll bring in Logic Space Designer. And I'm just going to make it a little bit more airy. And we'll just bring that down in volume. All right, next, let's go ahead and create a new software instrument track. And let's get to the drums. So we're gonna go to our user patches. I did create, as usual, a drum kit before this. Uh, video hit record. Um, where is it here? Right here, the no dribble drum kit. And let's start off with our snare. Pretty easy, create a pattern region. Put it on the three and we're good to go. Uh, let's get to our hi-hat first, and then we can get to that 808. That pretty much takes up a lot of space in the mix. And right over here, there's a roll. So we're gonna go to our brush tool. We're gonna change this over to a 30 second triplet. And uh, we're just gonna go ahead and draw that in right here. And we can just duplicate that. That's what it loops out for the four bars. Maybe we'll get to the open hat first. Let's go ahead and create a mini region over here. And draw on that open hat. And let's get to our rim shot and then we'll get to our 808. So we're gonna go ahead and draw in that rim shot. All 
All right, now let's draw in our 808. Once again, this takes up a huge space in this mix. So let's get to that. So there's the pattern right there. I'm just going to go ahead and stretch all those out here. And uh, this is what it sounds like. All right, now all we got to do is bring in that flute sound. I'm going to go ahead and mute this out because it's really just meant for transitional effects. I'm going to create a new software instrument track. And I'm going to go over to our browser tool over here. And we're going to go to World Woodwinds. And we're going to go to the... Indian Vansuri flute, and that's the sound we're going to use. I'm going to close that out. And let's go ahead and draw in that pattern. back a little bit. Let's go and just stretch all those out here and pull this back actually it doesn't need to stretch out there and we're going to duplicate it over the four bars stretch that out and it sounds something like this all right so that's pretty much the beat right there i'm going to go ahead and listen to the beat just to see how the arrangement goes and we're going to come right back So that right there is the Babies in Santa Fe Vegas track, No Dribble. For your logic users out there, I'm going to go ahead and save this entire session for you guys. Place it as a downloadable link in the description box below this video. For your non-logic users out there, got your back as well. I'm going to export all the me stems, audio stems, of course include the drum kit that we used in this remake. You can find that played back down below as well. If you do have any questions on this, we can go ahead and uh, talk and carry this conversation down in the comment section below. But that's it for me guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, 
remember to hit that thumbs up button and of course hit that subscribe button as well for more videos like this one. I'll talk to y'all soon. Later. Peace.